Hey guys, I just got home from shopping. I went to Walmart to look for those um, Rainbow High costume ball, costume ball um, dolls. And again, I didn't find any. So then, since I didn't find the Rainbow High dolls I was looking for, uh, I just bought some um, Halloween stuff, but that'll be in another haul, in a, in a small Walmart haul. Now I'm going to show you um, the stuff that I found at Dollar Tree. Actually, I went to two Dollar Trees, but one didn't have anything. This is all from just one Dollar Tree. Um, I finally found some Halloween things that I've been looking for for the past, like, six weeks or more. I couldn't believe it. I wasn't expecting to find anything again, because week after week is, is a disappointment, but I actually found a lot of stuff. Not everything, but a, a, a lot. So, um, I'll start off with this pile over here. Um, I've got more Robon transfers. These ones are different from the ones that I got last time. This one, they're like uh, vintage looking, like with the vintage um, art style with the, with the black cat. And then there's a vintage looking owl there too. And it says boo, and there's a spider, and bats, trick or treat, a snake, and another snake, and a pumpkin with a witch's hat on. And it says hooray for Halloween. <laughs> And then another skull, and then more snakes. I'm not really into the snakes that much, though. But I like the other ones. I like the owls, my favorite. And then the, the cat. And unfortunately, they only gave you one owl. And that one's my favorite one. And they only gave you one owl. They could have gave you two owl, owls instead of, like, three snakes over there. Um, I don't know how many you get on here. But, yeah, these, these are really cool. And then you get some ghosts over here, too. So I got those, and then I got another candle to put them on. This time I got an orange um, seven-day candle. I think these are called seven-day candles. Um, last time I got a, a, a purple one, and I'm not sure if it was a black one, a purple or black, but I know it was purple, and this time I got an orange one. So I got that to put the transfers on. And then I finally found these wooden boxes. Uh, they're painted, but they're wood. They're not plastic, like most of them are every year. This is one. This time, it, it's it, they're um, wood, and they're really tall. And I got the one with the black cat and the crescent moon and the spooky tree. They had another one. I forgot what what it looked like. I don't remember. I think it was a purple one, and then with a ghost. I'm not sure, but of course I had grabbed the black cat because anything with cats and and moons I I love, and it's really bright. And it has this, like, rope on here, like this twine, so you can hang it. Um, let me see if I can turn that on and show you. But it's super bright, so be warned, look away if bright lights bother you. Oh, you can't see it that well because it's too li uh, light already in the, in the kitchen. But yeah, it lights up. So I was happy to find these lanterns. And then this is not a Halloween item, but I found this unicorn trinket tray. And this is, this is really cute. I like stuff with unicorns. And then I got some mini M&Ms to put in that pumpkin um, gumball machine. Because uh, most candy doesn't fit in there. Because I bought Skittles when I bought, it last, when I bought that pumpkin gumball machine. And the Skittles are too big. So you have to buy mini M&Ms. And I haven't tested it out yet. But from what I heard from people online is that the mini M&Ms work. Also the Nerds candy and the Sixlets. I was looking for Sixlets, but both of my Dollar Trees didn't have any. But they did have Nerds candy. So hopefully it will work this time. Because I don't, I don't eat a lot of candy at once. So I already still have the Skittles from how I bought them last time. And then I got a... These mini glass containers, you get five pieces with like, with like, um, I don't know what the lids are on there, like metal or, or, or tin or something, tin I think. I just got those because I wanted to put some of this pretty sequence in there to decorate them with and just to put, to put them on my, on my small coffin shelf that I have. And I thought that would look pretty for like different purple colors for Halloween. This pack of sequins also has pinks. They're not just all purple. There's light pink, like uh, dark pink, three shades of pink, like a hot pink. This is a hot pink, but it looks red, but it's like a hot pink. 
and then like dark pink and light pink and then violet and like purple and I don't know what this one is like fuchsia you get six bags and then I got these cute little cat little toys I don't, I'm not cat toys for cats but they're called kitten cafe meow ball yarn ball meow ball meow ball yarn ball um, you make a there's a bracelet inside it says create your own uh, meow bowl bracelet but I didn't get it for the bracelet I just got it for the cute little cup that it comes in it's like a teacup and look how cute it is this one's pink and like she's closing her eyes and then the handles are is her tail and then I got three of them this one's like a mint green and every all the faces on these are different they all have different faces this one's mint green and her and her eyes are open and then I got a third one a purple one let me know if you guys if these come in any other colors because my Dollar Tree I only found these three colors this one's a, a, a purple one so these I can't wait to open these and like I said um I just got them for the cute little little cups that they that, that they come in so I got oh and my Dollar Tree I forgot to tell you um, one of my Dollar Trees they just had the empty box over there they were all sold out the, the box that they come in over there they're in the toy section by the way they're not at the impulse buy section at the register at the checkout they're in the toy section and the box was completely empty but at the second Dollar, dollar Tree I went to they had a lot of them the box was um, like 75% full at the second Dollar Tree I went to. So I'm glad I went to the second Dollar Tree, even though I didn't find no dollar, uh, no Halloween decorations that I wanted um, at the second Dollar Tree. And then I found, they have new dream catchers, guys. So if you're into, in, you're into dream catchers, they have new ones. They have cat ones in all different colors. This one has um, some black cat ears on top. And, and the feathers are black and the beads are black and then they also have a couple of brown feathers too and I've never seen a black dream catcher before with black feathers and black beads and the dream catcher is black and if you don't like this color guys they had like three other colors but I don't know what they were because this black one I like the best so they have four colors in total this black one and three other colors and they're all cats with like with cat ears And then, guys, I found the Creature Ioni line of uh, Halloween makeup. I wish I could got, could have gotten a lot more, but there's no way I could afford all, every single piece of makeup they had in this line. Because a lot of stuff I, I didn't get. But I got the, the makeup that I wear the most. I got blush. Because the most makeup that I buy and that I wear are blush and any lippy products. Like lipstick, lip gloss lip balm not lip balms I don't really use lip balms but lip gloss um, lipstick and and blush and eyeliner and I got this one this one's like the creature of like the from the blue lagoon I think but it, it's, a, it's a female yeah it says creature on there on the bottom so I can't wait to open that and see what what um, what it looks like and then I got another blush this one's the phantom and this one's pink this one's super pretty. I don't know if it's showing up, but the uh, the pink is so pretty there, like this. It's a really bright pink, like really bright pink. And I'm gonna save the boxes on these. I don't care if, if the same image is is on the lid on top of the blush over there. I, I like these boxes. And I didn't see any more blush guys at my Dollar Tree, unfortunately. The other one that I almost bought that I thought was blush, but it wasn't. I think it said it was some kind of like toner or something or highlight. So yeah, and then the only other one I got was this liquid lipstick. This one it says Miss Hyde. And this one's like a dark red, almost like a blood vampire red. Almost like a vampire blood red. They didn't have any other lips, liquid lipsticks or anything else, any other lippy products. Because I would have gotten maybe at least one more and then I would have left something else back. And I, unfortunately I didn't have money to get any of the eyeliner sets either. No, I didn't get any eyeliner. They also had mascara. They had a black one and a blue one. 
and they had like um like i said some some other stuff for your cheeks like toner or highlight or something they didn't have everything they were a lot of the stuff was already sold out but i was happy with what i did find even though i only found one liquid lipstick and then i got these paper plates just to eat out of um like out of uh pumpkin pie to use them to to eat um pumpkin pumpkin pie on and that pumpkin cream cheese roll so i love anything with with haunted houses i love haunted houses it says enter if you dare and it is a witch oh my god i didn't notice this at the store the witch has a a black cat on her on her broom there's a black cat sitting behind her there and let's see you get 18 in here that's a pretty good price that's uh, that's 18 plates for a dollar 25 And then these I can't show you guys. Um, I got two thank you cards and a Halloween card. Um, I got a thank you card for Disney Love and for Kathy's favorite things for sending me uh, recently sending me some Halloween happy mail. So Kathy and and Jennifer, you'll be uh, getting a thank you card soon in the mail. And then I got a Halloween card. When, you know those handmade Halloween cards they have up front of the store by the Halloween decorations when you walk in they found my Dollar Tree finally brought the Halloween uh, the handmade Halloween cards and I got one here just in case somebody um, sends me a Halloween card and I have to send send them one back so I can't show you it but it's really really nice it's really cute that's what I'll say it's not scary or spooky it's cute and then I got one of these mini spooky spot to the difference books uh, I like these. Uh, one year I got one from Walmart, but the one from Walmart was super expensive. I think it was five ninety nine. I think it was six dollars five ninety nine. And this one is not as thick as the one that the ones that Walmart carries, but it's still a good deal for a dollar twenty five if you can't afford the five ninety nine one from from Walmart. So I got that, and here's what the back looks like. It has some cute images in here, like this one with the black cat and the black cats in the tree and then this one's really cute too so yeah I got that and then I got this pack of stickers all these pumpkins are dressed up in different like Halloween costumes I like this black cat one right there of course the black cat and then this green witches one the only one I don't like is the clown. Um, I'm not into clown decorations except for Jack in the Box. I like those Jack in the Boxes that Walgreens had many, many years ago. That j one was Jill in the Box, it was female, and the other one was Jack in the Box. I bought both of them one year, but Jill in the Box broke because I didn't take the batteries out, which I didn't know at the time. You're supposed to remove the batteries if they're not in use for a long time because they explode. And they exploded. Um, the next year and I it didn't work anymore but otherwise I'm not into clowns just a jack-in-the-box and then this is other one I don't like either with this like red lightning bolt on its face it reminds me of the makeup from kiss or something but the rest I like I like this one this one's like Jason it has like a hockey mask face and then um, I like this one with the spider web a lot too on the bottom you can't it's not showing up but there's a spider web on it and a spider and this one's a unicorn and a butterfly and an alien yeah I'm into aliens guys so yeah I like this alien one and then I found guys the the pink figurines the collection of the of the pink uh, figurines I, I, I couldn't believe it uh, this this was my second most wanted on my, on my list aside of the witchy uh, signs and the witchy uh, theme stuff I found finally the the skull with the with the pink rose and the rib cage with the with the pink roses there's pink roses on top and then a pink rose over there and the 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 bottom of it is pink and then I like this a lot because I love anything with hearts and I love pink and roses so it's all three of my favorite things in one and it's like uh, the hands are into a heart shape and then the top looks like this 
and then there's a rose on the bottom. This reminds me of a wedding cake topper, guys. As soon as I saw people uh, posting this in their walkthroughs or on DollarTree.com when they first showed these images like two months ago, it reminded me right away of, of, of a wedding cake topper. And this would be good for a Valentine's decoration too. This would be perfect for, for Valentine's Day too. You can even maybe tie one of those helium balloons from it and you can use this like as a, as a balloon weight. And then guys, I'm, I, I love anything with crescent moons. And so, and pink's one of my favorite colors. So I finally found this. But guys, I almost missed out. They only had two of these left in the store. This one and one more. And only at one Dollar Tree. So if I didn't go today, if I went in another week, another seven to ten days, they both would have been gone. Thank God they had two, two left and they weren't broken or, or chipped or or uh, smudged with any bad paint job or anything. So look at that. The crescent moon is made out of roses on there. And then the stem is black. The stem is black and the pumpkin's light pink. And then this one too. This one is black and this one's oval. Sh the pumpkin's oval shape. And this one has pink roses on it instead of black. So like they switched the colors up on these two. And then I found these huge plastic lanterns that I also want to... This is, this is the biggest Halloween lantern that I ever, I ever saw um, Dollar Tree carry. This doesn't come with the, with the small cell batteries. This takes, I think, two AAA batteries. And they're not included. Yes, yeah, it's two AAA. N not included. And um, look, this is huge compared to the other lanterns that Hollow, the Dollar Tree releases every year. Look how big it is compared to this wo cat wooden one. Look at that. Look how wide, much wider and taller it is. And this one I like because it has a spooky skeleton on here with like a, with a graveyard with like some tombstones and a cemetery gate in the corner over there. And then it has a bat. And I love bats. And then it has the image all around it in the front side and back, all four sides. And it, it, you, can, you can hang it. And this one's plastic. It's not wooden. Oh, they also have another one. They have an orange one with jack-o'-lanterns. So if this one's too spooky for you or for your kids, or if you're not into skeletons or like the graveyard that much, you can get the more friendly looking one, the orange one with the, with the jack-o'-lanterns. And guys, I'm going to show you now the witchy stuff now, my favorite, that I saved my favorite for last. I found this uh, sign that you put on your table, it's a tabletop sign, this one with the lunar spells on here. And then they give you like the phases of the moon, and it gives you a bunch of spells to do for each phase of the moon on here. It says waning, last quarter, waning crescent moon, waxing crescent first quarter waxing gibbons, waning gibbons, new moon. So yeah, I love stuff like this. Witchy stuff is my favorite. And there's a, there's a cat over here. There's a black cat over there on the bottom. It says lunar spells. And then on the back, it just has this uh, thing like the f photo frames do, where you can put it, you can stand it up on the table like this. And then I found this one. This one is just supposed to look like some books. It says potions, spells, charms, and w witch tales. And then it has a skull over here on the bottom. I didn't see that. And then there's a raven sitting on a skull, an owl, and a witch on the top. And this one says charms on here. Oh, and there's a black cat up there. And they're all different colors. One's a black book, one's a burgundy one, one's a brown book, and one's a purple. Oh no, I forgot something else to show you guys besides the witchy signs. Crap. The towels, the dish towels. I finally found the Halloween dish towels, guys. This one says trick or treating with my nomies. 
and I love the fence, this graveyard fence. I love that. That's that cemetery or graveyard fence. And one's dressed as a witch, one's dressed as a black cat, one's dressed like as a wizard, and then one's dressed up as Frankenstein's monster. And then it has some spooky trees on the side. Unfortunately, I couldn't get all all the ones, all the Halloween dish towels, including the the sets that they came with, with the oven mitts and the pot holders. It's just too much to buy everything. But I got some things. Oh, look, and it has a half moon. It has a crescent moon on top. Look at that. But I got this one because this one was my favorite. But I didn't have money to get the matching oven mitt with it and, and the pot holder, unfortunately. And then I got this oven mitt. mitt. This is Happy Haunting with the black truck. It says Ghoul's Pumpkin Delivery. And lo look at that. On the front of the truck, there's a there's a raven or a crow on there, perched on, on, on the on the hood of the truck. And there's bats all over it. I love bats and I love crows. So I got that, and then I got the matching dish towel. They also had um, a set with a haunted house, and I, I I couldn't get that, but they have another set. With a with a dish towel with a haunted house on it. Okay, guys, I found some most of the witchy signs. This one says witch vibes, and there's the constellations over there with the crystal ball, and there's a, like a, an eye inside the crystal ball, and there's a crescent moon, and like I said, it says witch vibes. And I like this a lot. This is, I'm going to leave this out all year round. This isn't for me. I'm into witchy stuff all year round. So this is going to be out all the time. And so is all these signs are going to be out all year round for me. All this witchy stuff. This one says palmistry guide. Inquire within.